CD4070, it is XOR IC, it has 4 XOR gate, XOR 1, 2, 3 and 4. So these are the 4 XOR gate, pin number 7, it is ground, pin number 14 is positive supply, we can supply from plus 3 volt to 18 volt. Let's say these are the two input A and B and Y is the output. We can write XOR as A XOR B equal to Y. Whenever A and B are 0, then we'll get 0. A0 B1 will get 1. A1 B0 will get 1. A and B are 1, then we'll get 0. If the input is same, then we'll get 0. And whenever the inputs are different, then you will get 1 as a output. So this is the XOR. For the practical, we will use get number 1. Get 1 means pin number 1, 2 and output is 3. We will provide the inputs with a switch. And other pin of the switch is connected to the plus 5 volt. With the input, we have to connect pull down resistor. And I already explained why should we connect the pull down resistor with the input of digital IC. Link is given in the description below. The value of the resistor is 10 kilo ohms. And to see the input, we have to connect LEDs. The value of series resistor is 220 ohms. And to see the output, we will connect LED. Input A, input B, and Y is the output. And this is the truth table of XOR. Now we will see this in practical. Pin number 7 is ground pin. 14 is positive. Pin number 1 and 2 are the input. So connecting pull down resistor. Input A and B. One pin of the switch is connected to the positive rail. To see the input connecting the LEDs. Pin number 3 is output. And with this we have to connect an LED. Input A to the pin number 1, input B to the pin number 2. Connecting both the positive and negative rails. Connecting 5 volt positive and negative. Head is positive and negative. Both the input is 0, we are getting 0. One input is 1, we are getting 1. Another input is 1, we are getting 1. And whenever both the input is 1, we are getting 0. So this is the XOR gate. So this is the basic thing of CD4070. So guys, this is all for today. Thanks for watching.